can be tough to stay motivated in the winter season when, well, who even wants to go outside? But luckily, there are small changes you can make to your fitness and nutrition that will boost your mood this month. So here to share more is health and wellness coach Kira Anderson. Kira, as always, thanks for being here today. Thanks for having me. Okay, so I have not seen the sun in quite a bit. I know. And it's tough. It's so these tough. are real tips that you can do that you're going to see a difference, which is what I love about them. They're easy and they're effective. Absolutely. I know a lot of people suffer from seasonal affective disorder, and yeah. I think you guys talked about that yesterday. Yeah. I'm actually one of them. Yeah. Um, so a few things we can do. First is journaling. So in the mornings, I try yeah. to write five things down that I'm grateful for. I love that. I also love journaling at night. Mm. It really helps getting things out on paper. Yeah. And then if you have those five things you're grateful for, whenever whenever you have time during the day, yeah. just write it down. Yeah. Then you can focus on it. It kind of sets that positive mood, the positive tone. Right. To for the see, rest of your day. because usually you wake up and you're like, oh, I have another day, and the sun's not and out. Then the sun's not out. I heard a quote once that um, if you think about your when you have a car, you always can recognize your car right yeah. around the community when you but you don't recognize that car unless you own that car right and that's what gratitude's like yeah you once you say those things suddenly you're more likely to recognize them so yes. I'm all about this yes okay absolutely. I'm curious about number two though yeah. what because I love cinnamon cinnamon I it's know. delicious so cinnamon is really really good for you okay there's a lot of antioxidants it's antimicrobial but during the winter what it can do yeah. is it actually can help warm your body a little bit oh okay. so it helps with your immune system yeah so you can put it in your coffee yeah, I um, my kids love cottage cheese, so I put it yeah. on their cottage oh, cheese. Delicious. It kind of makes it more of a decadent yeah. um, treat, but it's just really, really good for you, especially or in the winter. On the apples and apples, oh, yes. I'm or apple sauce. Hungry. Yes. Yes. Okay, and I know with that, a lot of it is the movement is so important still in the yes. winter, too. Absolutely. We always talk about when I come on here, drinking water, yeah. moving, those things, you got to continue those through the winter. So, again, I suffer, too. It's yeah. a struggle for me. So I have yeah. to carry my big water bottle around every day. I figure out, what am I going to do? Yeah. One thing that's amazing during the winter, even when it's cloudy outside, it's getting outside no matter what. Okay. So it's not that there's um, bad weather, there's just bad yeah. clothes. So you got to yeah. bundle up, mm -hmm. even in the winter, get outside and walk 20 yeah. to 30 minutes. Um, it will help boost your mood. Yeah. And then you still get that vitamin D, even when it's cloudy, but yeah. especially when it's sunny outside, get okay. outside. And speaking of that vitamin D, let's talk yeah. supplements real quick here. Yes, yes. So uh, a lot of us in the Midwest here are deficient in vitamin D, yeah. bulk acid, B6. Yeah. So my suggestion is to offer these to yourself yeah. during the winter. Okay. Um, vitamin D is vitally important for yeah. your mood. Um, same thing with folic acid. So yeah. those are great vitamins to add in. It helps your nervous system regulate. Um, so vitamin D and folic acid. I definitely, I definitely know that I could, I could use yes, that vitamin D. So I'm glad that, that you yes. mentioned that. We have Jim's over here reporting the weather, getting it ready to go, and it's chilly. I it's know. only getting chillier. It's only going to be chillier. <laughs> I know, I know. All so right. we do what we can, we right? We do what we can. Well, you can Kira, thank you so much for yes, these easy course. tips and tricks. You can learn more by following along on socials or visiting her website. And if you want to get moving, ride with Kira at True Fusion.